Okay, guys, we're unboxing some of our stuff because we're going to be camping, quote unquote. So we have never camped on an RV. So initially, it's going to cost quite a bit to um, get what you need. So we need the water hose, of course. We got the 50 foot. And we've been watching YouTube, and they said that's not the right one to get. But guess what? We got it. <laughs> and now, uh, let's see. What are we getting? Okay, well, some people. That's your personal preference. Um, we don't know, so we're just, just going with the flow, right? And this is a side winder. Hold it up, okay? So that's when you have your stinky slinky. And if you don't know what a stinky slinky is, that's like the hose for your um, bathroom excrement that flows through there. So according to all the videos, you need to have that propped up so it flows downhill and your toilet doesn't back up. So we definitely don't want the toilet backing up. So the stinky, slinky sidewinder. And this stuff all comes in nice storage things, but you know when you open stuff and you take it out of the storage bin, and you're not even right. you're not able to put it back in. We're not even able to open it. So we definitely can't put it back in. <laughs> we shall see. And there is the stinky stinky holder. So it kind of keeps it propped up. So we'll show you when we get everything all sorted where it goes if we do it right. And we got some fuses. Here's the fuses. You gotta have the fuses just in case um, you blow a fuse. And let me tell you, we rented an RV and we did blow a fuse. Could not find the fuse anywhere. And we were in BFE, Alabama, and no one knew how to work on RVs. So you definitely want to have some fuses. So that's it for now. We will definitely be unboxing some more stuff. And as we unbox them, I will let you see. But again, you know, initially, it's going to cost you to get set up to get all this stuff because this is stuff you need. It's not things we want. So once we get everything we need, then we'll start getting some wants. All right, that's it. Oh, let's see what's in the bag. Uh, okay, well, that was not RV related. <laughs> All right, let's see what's in the box. Oh, that's the watchdog. Ooh, who let the dogs out? <laughs> so cool. Okay, guys. So we got another package. Let's see what it is. I think our RV collection should be complete. We have spent so much money on this stuff. Box, of course, inside a box. Oh, it's my dual air fryer. Um, so we're not gonna, we rarely use a stove even in our um, sticks and bricks or bricks and sticks. So we're not gonna be pretty much using the stove or the burners in the RV. Most of our food is done via air fryer. So we decided to get a dual and we're gonna sit on top of the stove because we rarely use the stove. So the microwave and the air fryer are our go-to. Um, so that's it and we will show you more when we start to use it. All right guys, we got more gear. So let's see what we have. I think eventually we're gonna have enough stuff to go through the basic, but again, when you first start out, you need quite a bit of stuff. Oh, uh, those must be the wheel covers. Oh, yeah. well, can you open them, pull them up and stuff like those? Yeah, those are the... Okay, so those are the wheel covers, or so they look like. So, apparently, with RVs, they have to have wheel covers when they're sitting in the sun or it'll mess up your tires, which is interesting because your car sits in the sun all the time and the tires don't 
get messed up, but I guess that's why it's an RV. I don't know. I love the breeze of cubs in there. Oh, cool. Nice. All right. Until the next time. Okay, we got something else, guys. It, that one's pretty straightforward. It is, what is it? It's a uh, electric. It is a surge protector. It's a surge protector. A surge guard or whatever you want to call it. Where's that go? That goes on, oh, the electrical outlet. Okay, so it's going to go on the electrical outlet to keep from blowing off the RV. That's it. That's it. Cool, you yeah. There you go, because we have a 50 watt, at least I hope we do 50 volt. All right, there's more coming. So, again, like I said earlier, when you first start out, there's so many things that you have to get in order to be um, camp ready. So, here's another package that we just got. That is, oh, gloves. Gloves. Yeah. Yep, because you need gloves to change the stinky slinky. You definitely want gloves and you want disposable gloves. So I, for one, will not be doing the stinky slinky thing. Oh, another one. <laughs> the Amazon guy knows our name now. It's definitely going on our Christmas list. <laughs> what is that? Oh, it's a coffee cup. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, it's a can of, Duster. two cans of air spray. Air spray. Okay. Well, it's like what you use on computer. I had some that already. I had a can of that already. Now we have two extra cans. Okay. All right. All right. We have a large box coming. My daughter in the background. Alright. Motion <laughs> <in> <laughs> Oh, and there it is toilet paper, special RV toilet paper. Can you hold it up for a minute? Let me see it. Special RV kaboo. Okay. It's RV toilet paper. Didn't know there was such a thing. Some more blocks. Well, you know what? If that truck rolls or that trailer rolls after all that. That's a serious truck. We went to the Lowe's today and we got some um, plywood, or not plywood, just I guess lumber. Cut a two, cut by, six, a two by six and we got it cut into three pieces. We bought three of those. So we have like nine. Another water pump. Another water filter. And another water filter. We'll have clean water or filter water at least. So that's it till for now, guys. One more. One more. Oh, nope, I, I lied. What is that? I don't know. <laughs> He's right a... Oh, my torque wrench. Oh, the torque wrench. Did check you already buy some more wrench? Oh, to check the lugs on the tires. Wait. And there's more. <laughs> this for the house. Oh, that's what I was asking about today. That's a water filter too? No. Oh. This goes from a 30 down to a 15. Okay. Electrical. Uh, let's see what this is. Okay. Water splitter. Okay, water splitter. Yep, and I see my daughter peeking around the corner. That's Tape. her apartment. Tape. Okay. And one more. Oh, we're not going to have room for anything but all this equipment. Damp rid. Oh, yeah. You need damp rid. All right. That's it. That's it. All right, guys. Until the next time. You need a pack and box. Record <laughs> button. Uh -huh. All right. Go ahead. I need to hit this record button. Track yeah. actual map. Oh, cool. Thanks. Mm -hmm. I'll get into it. Now I won't. Uh, Alright, I'm not going to be further away then. Oh. So, what is that? Stabilizers for the tire. Oh, tire stabilizers. Let me get a better look at it. Huh? Okay.
Sure. Doesn't look any different. Chops. Chops. So we can do some leveling. So I think that's going to be the hard part, is trying to figure out how to level it. But hopefully we'll figure that out. So we don't... I guess you can't turn the trailer over. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But hopefully we don't. <laughs> we got enough stuff to start a store here, guys. I think we may have bought... I don't know. It seems like we bought a lot of stuff. I don't know if we need all this stuff, but... They say you need it all. We'll see. What is that? Antifreeze? No, it's detergent for the toilet. Oh, detergent for the toilet. Cleaning? You pour it down there and keep it, make it so clean up and stuff. Ah, okay. All right then, that's it for today. Okay, I got the ice maker in. Yay! That's like my favorite thing. I've been waiting on this because our RV does not have an ice maker in the refrigerator. They said it's a residential refrigerator, but I don't know what kind of resident they live in with that small refrigerator. But anywho, that's why I got the ice maker. So DK is unboxing it now. Construction book. Maybe he's unboxing it. <laughs> Turn it over. Turn it to the side and then slide it out. Yeah. Should have just take the thing slide it out. See how big it is. It's supposed to be compact. Looks like it's kind of compact. storage room. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn around. Turn around. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to read the instructions on it and then I will put some water in it and let it make some ice and when I get it all set up, I will come back and show you guys how it works. Alright, here we go. All right, we have more stuff. Yay. Let's see what this is. Oh, that's the screens. This right. are the screens to cover up all the crevices so the little critters don't get in. So what I've seen on YouTube is that mice get into your trailer. If that happens, I think I won't be an RVer, you guys. So. Let's hope the mice don't get me. All right, opening up the next package. What is that? That's a slide oil for the slides. Okay. You rub around the rubber on the slides and stuff to make it look smooth. Cool. Right. Well, there's so much maintenance. I didn't know there was that much maintenance in it. And that's the caulking stuff, right? Yeah, caulking for seals and stuff. And for any holes, because I'm going to take that caulk and I'm going to seal up every hole because I do not want any mice getting into that. Uh, that's it. That's it. That large box with just those two little things. Okay. So, again, guys, this is the most important thing we've ever purchased. Because again, I don't do field mice. I don't. All right. So until we get more stuff, thanks for joining. All right. We have even more stuff. Yay. This came really quick. I just ordered it today. Oh my God. That's a level. Oh. So leveler. Because you're supposed to use that to level out the RV. Oh, this is a level. My level sucks, so quickly. Yeah. Doesn't roll down the hill. Come on, partner. Oh, this is your stinky, stinky sewer thing that is, from what I hear, is required at some campsites by law. So, hitch bone lubricant. And that's it. Yeah. And the house is really junky right now because it's full of RV stuff, so just a minute. Oh, water 
Okay. Nope. Huh? All right, lithium grease. Okay, so we got lubricant and we got lithium grease. So, hey, we're going to be slipping and sliding. <laughs> All right. That's more stuff. Okay. If this RV and doesn't go well, we'll have one hell of a garage sale. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we just got more stuff in. Let's see what's in here. This we got from Walmart, so I don't know what it is. <clears throat> so far, just plastic bags. <laughs> so far, just plastic bags. We may need those plastic bags. That's a weight to it. What is it? You cut this up for a kill myself. <laughs> hey, look, get it to yourself. I'm not going to be able to drive the RV. <laughs> Plenty of packing. Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Box inside the box. Let's see. There we go. Right. What is that? It's a magic cake. 